In this video for Pack and Ship Business Centers, we're gonna talk about the advent of the explosion in e-commerce, how it's impacting your business and how to take advantage through digital mailbox. Brandon, lovely to speak to you. Good to see you too. So something's happened in the last couple of years in particular, which is the advent of e-commerce. We're talking, of course, about Amazon here, exploding the number of packages sent. Can you tell me a little bit about how that's impacting the market? Uh, yeah, certainly. Uh, Amazon is the juggernaut out there. They handle a huge piece of just about anything that's sold in the United States right now. And, and customers have a challenge on receiving those things that they buy from Amazon and other e-com retailers. And the digital mailbox service is a package receiving service in addition to mail receiving service. Right. And just as it handles mail for people, we can handle the packages as well. So somebody that's a digital mailbox customer can have all of their shipments go to the store that, that supports it mm. and then decide how to get it into the hands of the consumer after it's been received at the store. This makes a lot of sense to me because, you know, okay, I'm an Amazon Prime guy. Me too. I hope that's not a crime. I think me it's a too. good thing. Uh, and so we have a mess of stuff delivered, but we are not always there. And it does worry me to have things sort of show up on my doormat. And are they going to be there when I get home? So, and I may want it sent to me somewhere else. How does Digital Mailbox kind of respond to that? Well, you mentioned something that's critically important. I think most people out there that have received a package recently know what a porch pirate is. <laughs> FedEx, thing or, now. <laughs> FedEx or UPS may leave a package on your porch and then people drive around and follow them and swipe it. It's, oh, a, it's man, an up and growing wow. crime. It's a growth industry out there. So in that context, we are secure. Any packages that are delivered by FedEx, UPS, the Postal Service, DHL, Amazon, or a courier, we're there all the time. We can sign for it. So chain of custody is there. And if, you're, if you are in Australia, I'm going to scan that package, show you what it is, and if you need it, I'll send it to you. We're shipping experts. Right. That's what we do. Right. So we've got it end to end. And if you want it delivered to your home and it's local, you don't have to leave again. We can have it sent directly to you. That makes a lot of sense. And then the other thing I love about this is, let's say I'm shopping from outside the country, and a lot of people won't ship outside the country, so I can ship to my address in the U.S. I can uh, get, gather all that up and have you send it to me in one package. Is that what's that? There's a name for that. Consolidation. Okay. Technical. I knew it was technical. Yes. Well, it, it makes a lot of sense because it's a lot less expensive to send one package than it is multiples. So, for instance, if you had a bunch of purchases that you're making here, we can collect them and tell you we have them all in place for you, put them in, professionally pack them and put them into another box and then them, send them on to whatever address you designate. This makes a lot of sense. It does. I appreciate it. Uh, for those who would like to find out more about the iPostal One service in particular, please go to iPostalOne.com. And uh, look, if this is a great answer for you and your pack and ship business and a way to expand your business beyond the international borders and even to Australia. It's true. There are even people even in Australia. In Australia. <laughs>